Hello folks, um, we have a wonderful workshop lined up for this weekend, uh, weekend of August 23-24 on, um, on arithmetic and so promises to be a, a bonanza. Uh, if, you're, if you're preparing in any kind of seriousness for CAT, you should think very seriously about this. And so the, the, the big syllabus, big chunk which needs to be conquered is, is quant. Uh, and in that arithmetic is the, is the elephant in the room. And if, you, if, you're, if you're saying, look, I'll be the king of arithmetic, you're good. You're ninety percent there, and so you, you, if you get all the arithmetic questions correct in CAT, there is every chance that you're scoring 94th percentile in quant. Straight away, you pass all section cutoffs. You're waltzing in. Arithmetic typically forms forty to fifty percent of the paper. Eight, nine, ten, eleven questions usually. You get them. You put them in the bag. You're done. You don't need anything else. Or if you're the absolute king here, you have more freedom in selecting other questions, and so. Definitely, definitely sign up for this. It can transform your score. It can transform your confidence. Right? So, arithmetic topics, fundas are simple, straightforward, but the questions are usually layered. What do I mean by that? There will be a question that involves profit and loss that will touch upon ratio and then talk about maximum and minimum. So, there's a question on, on mixtures that will link and kind of reference percentages and talk about an inequality. So, they will they'll bring many things onto one page. So, you cannot just say, look, I know 10 formula, I'll bring it. You need to build layers to your understanding of arithmetic. So we're really, really, really good at this. We're really good at saying, look, you have the basics, you have the fundas, you've learned, you know what is profit percentage, loss percentage, you know what 2 is to 3 is, you know what allegations are, you know what pipes and cisterns are, you can know how work time equations can be framed, you're very comfortable doing the LCM part, taking the reciprocal, all of that. But now we're going to throw you with a bunch of questions that are, that are mixed across these and push you real hard. Right? So you have to have to learn from basics, from absolute fundamentals. Everything we teach is from scratch, from fundas. It is absolutely essential to learn from fundas. All these uh, fancy formulae of the, uh, I keep hearing how like 1 minus AB, A by 100 plus B by 100 minus AB by 100, whatever not. And so all of that is, is intuitive. If you don't have the formula, and it's sometimes confusing and toxically bad if you use a formula. And so we, 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 we will use the simplest funda and build on them. And we have a power packed bonanza of a, of a, of a schedule. We do a three hour uh, theory on, on Saturday. It's rapid theory. Nobody can teach theory for, uh, for uh, arithmetic in three hours. We cannot, we cannot do that. And so, but we want to make ideas fresh in your head. We want to say, hey, in speed time distance, we'll talk about speed time distance. We'll talk about uh, uh, boats and streams, we'll talk about uh, platform and train crossing something, we'll talk about relative speed, we'll talk about races, we'll talk about circular races, give you a, a refresher of everything under that. Do maybe two or three very simple questions in each topic, kind of get all ideas up very fresh in your head and then set you up for Sunday. That's the plan. Sunday what do we do? We have a wonderful format, very time tested format. We do four sessions of two parts each. So there'll be a test from 9 to 9.50 on percentages, profit and loss and simple interest, compound interest. 10 to 10.50, we'll discuss that. You'll have typically 12 to 15 questions, 15 minutes, timed test on a wonderful interface. You finish that, uh, you'll have to worry about selecting the right questions, doing the right sequence, taking chances or not taking chances, uh, revisiting questions, coming back to them in an, in an exam setting. For 12 to 15 questions for 15 minutes, finish the talk. Drink some water, be ready, and then come back and sit with us to the discussion of these. And we'll, we'll discuss every single question. There's a gigantic value in learning from first principles, uh, very powerful ideas in simple topics. And so, uh, I believe that if you crack this part, then you are 90% through with your cat quant preparation. You're, you're, you'll have a straight line to 93, 94th percentile in quant. And then you're ready for other bits and bobs. This is the elephant in the room, the big, big daddy. Right? Last year, this was a phenomenal workshop for us. Lots of people chimed in. It was high energy, full of enthu, full of josh. It was a, it was a, it was a, it was a big, happy day. We all, at the, at the end of Sunday evening, at 5.30 or something, just said, you're dead tired. Because you've done three hours on Saturday and eight hours on Sunday. And then we add different bits and bobs in between. So you hardly had time to just sit up and grab a coffee or lunch in between this, this jam-packed schedule. But you have a nice, wonderful, relaxed smile at the end of it. Saying, look, this was good stuff. I would love to do it again. 
and so we would leave you with that feeling uh, so do sign up for it think about it very seriously jump in all the details about prices courses schedule time this all of this available in the description look forward to seeing many of you best wishes for care